Okay, and action. Petition E, take two, Mark. Hi, my name is Jaden Marty. My name is Ambar Raghavan. I'm Viviana. I'm Eli Sternoff, and I was a producer on the Half to History Project on Ellen Garrison. Ellen Garrison. Ellen Garrison. And um, I'm gonna be honest, I didn't know anything about her. I was talking to people and the cast and the crew, and I was like, do you guys know about Ellen Garrison, or is this just me? And they were also like, no, I didn't know anything about her. And I think everyone was a little embarrassed about that, but then we kind of just collectively realized that's what makes this project so important. What we're trying to do with Half the History is tell some of the untold and undertold stories of women's lives. So we're focusing on American women and actively looking for women whose stories just haven't made it into the press or into history books. So one of these women that we discovered was Ellen Garrison. And what was so exciting was that the whole town of Concord and Tufts, all the students, faculty, they all came together to recreate this parade, which had over 70 people. Jen, of course, teaches a class about producing for film, and, and her students were centrally involved in all aspects. Casting and props through the locations, and figuring out the transportation, because it was in Concord. So, I mean, these kinds of things that are actually nitty-gritty of being a producer. When you're able to actually make something that you care about making all together, it brings it all to life. I didn't realize producers do everything before the shoot. I didn't know there was months of preparation in order to get to where you're able to film. We needed to convert the Robbins house from its current form back into its 19th century form. The entire atmosphere on set was very, very welcoming, and they really put me to work. On the shoot, I got on a very tall ladder and rigged a massive light with a very large lantern on it to this eight-foot pipe. And then just the first day of class, our costume came in, and I said, oh, I have experience. I've taken fashion history courses. I'm actually really passionate about this, and immediately it was an opportunity for me to work with our customer. To do the film justice, it's these little details that make it so beautiful, I feel. Getting all the permits and the logistics surrounding when to film those scenes, that's something that surprised me. I didn't know how difficult it was going to be to get certain locations and how important it was to just have like natural wood or like desks that Ellen would actually sit in or have feather pens and like windows that just looked and felt like that time period. It was a lot of tasks that amalgamated into something really satisfying. It was an experience that empowered me and made me feel like I can do this. Ellen Garrison had to make her own opportunities, so it burns a fire under me even more to take complete advantage of the opportunities, not just having to make for myself, but the ones laid before me, and that there's open doors, and I'm able to go through them and then lead others through that same way. And that's a wrap.